Do you know which game made racing with objects so popular? Hey, hey, what's up, gamers? A new day, a new video on Keto Gamer X. Today is a TVT of classic games. Oh, yeah. And comes with us Mario Kart from Super Nintendo. The game that popularized racing with objects. Stay until the end of the video and we will give you active slitter IO codes for October with a variety of outfits that customizes our peculiar character to the maximum. Without further ado, let's hit it gamers! On September 1st on North America and on January 21st, 1993 on Europe, Super Mario Kart for Super Nintendo was released. With only one year of development and 8 people working, the result was 8.76 million copies sold and a game that popularized the object racing genre. Driving plays a very important role. Controlling the car is easy but mastering it, it is difficult. Knowing when to brake, skating, dodging obstacles, it is essential to know the best lines. However, this was not the initial idea of the development team. Don't forget to leave us your comments telling us what's the best game of Super Nintendo for you if you play it once. Super Mario Kart divides the screen in two when we play alone. Above is the pilot in third person on the track and below is a map of the circuit. The controls are very simple. Since we will only use the crosshead to steer the vehicle and another four buttons to accelerate, brake, throw objects and start a jump or a skid. Obviously, as in any driving game, the goal is to win every possible race. The difference is that here we can use objects that will touch us when passing through the different surprise boxes located on the track. From placing bananas and throwing shells to using turbos or start to be invincible, there is a sufficient variety of items. The reception of this by each driver is usually fair, that is the farthest behind have better weapons. Curiously, this balance gives the races that uncertainty that is already a hallmark of the saga. The game is very fun, challenging and limitless. There are always reasons to play again, see improved times or dominate a character. This Esnes installment advocates well-known modes such as Grand Prix, Battle Mode, Time Attack and the Match Race. A race where only two players compete. Grand Prix consists of winning over the 50cc and 100cc displacement in three cups of five circuits each. As we advance in this mode, the difficulty will increase as well as the speed of the cards. If we get the goal in the two categories and in all the cups, we will unlock a fourth cup 
and a displacement of 150 cc.
Wow, if you are here, it's because you liked the video and you wanted to know how to get the Slitters IO codes to customize the skin or skins uniquely to our character. In this way, they give us a personal version as well as long hours of fun. In the description of the video, you will find the link that takes you to the page of the code. I hope you enjoy them and leave us your comment if any of those don't work to keep them updated. We want to thank the comments in the previous videos. Make an honorable mention to some of our followers. In this case, we are mentioning to Sami Bob a uh, really good subscribers that comments all the time and leave us a really nice comment. Please go visit her channel and subscribe, she got really good gameplays. Remember that we will be drawing some uh, gift cards uh, when we reach the thousand subscribers. It could be an Amazon car, it could be an Xbox car or V-Box for the Fortnite game. So leave us your comments like and subscribe if this is the first time on our channel to participate and we will be informing the day of the draw in our next videos we will be leaving in the description the links of the followers that we mentioned in this video so that you also follow them and check their content it's really awesome without further ado don't give up gaming thank you so much for watching and see you next time